specific heat capacity for gases. Monatomic gases. The molecule of monatomic gas has three translatory degrees of freedom. Thus, the average energy of a molecule at temperature T is 3 by 2 kBT. Thus, the total energy of one mole of such a gas is U is equal to 3 by 2 kBT into Na is equal to 3 by 2 RT. Therefore, the molar specific heat at constant volume Cv is du by dt is equal to 3 by 2 r. We know that Cp minus Cv is equal to r, which implies Cp is equal to Cv plus r is equal to 3 by 2 r plus r. Therefore, the molar specific heat at constant pressure Cp is equal to 5 by 2 r. The ratio of specific heat for a monatomic gas is gamma is equal to Cp by Cv is equal to 5 by 3. Diatomic gas. If a diatomic molecule is treated as a rigid rotor like dumbbell, it will have 5 degrees of freedom, 3 translational and 2 rotational. According to law of equipartition of energy, the total energy of a mole of such a gas is U is equal to 5 by 2 kBT, Na is equal to 5 by 2 RT. Therefore, molar heat capacity of a diatomic molecule at constant volume is Cv is equal to du by dt is equal to 5 by 2 R, which implies Cp is equal to Cv plus R is equal to 5 by 2 R plus R is equal to 7 by 2 R. Therefore, molar specific heat capacity at constant pressure is Cp is equal to 7 by 2 R and gamma is equal to Cp by Cv is equal to 7 by 5. If a diatomic molecule is not rigid but has in addition a vibrational mode, then it will have 7 degrees of freedom, 3 translational, 2 rotational and 2 vibrational modes. Therefore, total energy of a mole of such a gas will be U is equal to 5 by 2 kBT plus 2 into 1 by 2 kBT into Na is equal to 7 by 2 RT. Therefore, Cv is equal to du by dt is equal to 7 by 2 R. Cp is equal to Cv plus R is equal to 9 by 2 R. And gamma is equal to Cp by Cv is equal to 9 by 7. 3. Polyatomic gas. In general, a polyatomic gas molecule will have three translational, three rotational degrees of freedom and certain number f vibrational modes. According to law of equipartition of energy, one mole of such a gas has total internal energy. U is equal to 3 by 2 kBT plus 3 by 2 kBT plus F kBT into Na is equal to 3 plus F into RT. Molar specific heat capacity at constant volume is Cv is equal to du by dt is equal to 3 plus F into R and Cp is equal to Cv plus R is equal to 3 plus F into R plus R is equal to 4 plus F into R and gamma is equal to Cp by Cv is equal to 4 plus F by 3 plus F. Specific heat capacity of solids. Consider a solid substance whose each molecule is vibrating about its mean position. The average energy due to vibration is one dimension is 2 into 1 by 2 kBT is equal to kBT, one corresponding to kinetic and other potential energy. In three dimensions, the average energy is 3 kBT. Therefore, total internal energy for a mole of a solid substance is U is equal to 3 kBT, Na is equal to 3 RT. According to first law of thermodynamics, delta Q is equal to delta U plus P delta V.
is equal to delta u as delta v is negligible at constant pressure. Hence, specific heat of a solid substance is C is equal to delta Q by delta T is equal to delta U by delta T is equal to 3R. Specific heat capacity of water. For each atom of water, the average energy is 3 kBT. As the water molecule has three atoms, two hydrogen and one oxygen, the total internal energy is U is equal to 3 into 3 kBT and A is equal to 9 RT. And specific heat capacity C is equal to delta Q by delta T is equal to delta U by delta T is equal to 9 R.